To record lectures with Collaborate, you must have a microphone headset. You can buy a microphone headset at any office supply store or borrow one from the LSSC Libraries and Learning Centers. Make sure your microphone headset is plugged into your computer before starting this tutorial. Open your browser and go to blackboardcollaborate.com. Click the Sign in Here link located at the top right of the page. Enter your username and password if asked. Click the Display Schedule button located at the top right of the page. Click the Join link next to the name of your Collaborate Room. Links appear at the bottom of the page. In most cases, the link to your Collaborate Room is the same as your name. After your room loads, run the audio wizard to ensure your microphone is working properly. Click the microphone icon to run the audio wizard. If you are using a PowerPoint file for your lecture, click the Load Content button located at the top right of the screen. Then select the PowerPoint file you are using for your lecture and click Open. Click the Record button located at the top right of your Collaborate screen. Click the Talk button. Start lecturing. Use the arrows at the top right of the screen to scroll through your PowerPoint as you speak. You can also use the web tour and app sharing features in Collaborate during your recording. When you have finished your lecture, click the Recording button located at the top right of your screen. Exit your Collaborate room by closing the window. Wait 5 to 10 minutes. Collaborate needs this time to process your recording. Go to your Collaborate room's Recordings URL. This URL was provided in the email with your login information. You should have received this email when you graduated from Collaborate training. The link leads to a list of recordings made in your Collaborate Room. Right-click the link for your lecture. It should be the last one on the list, but you can always double-click the link and watch the presentation to make sure. After you've right-clicked the link, choose either Copy Link Address, Copy Link Location, or Copy Shortcut, depending on your browser. Paste the link in your Blackboard course or an email to share it with students. To make the lecture a permanent part of your Blackboard course, include it as a web link in the week, unit, or module with which it corresponds.